now it's capturing my mic. Alright, I'm gonna be right back. Give me a sec. that like we just beat I think so. I think we just beat the toy factory. Something. The toy one where where humanity's ruled by. I know. A toy shop. Toy shop. We just beat toy shop. And now we need to find another key. And to find a key, we need to complete a puzzle. This was the first one fairly obvious. Hey, here's a picture. Make it look like the picture. I can turn the lights on and off and on and off and on and off and on and off and etc. Take that, Charles Darwin. And that's, uh, Kronos. I don't know what that one is. I know the Kronos one. Oh, boy. Okay. Cain and Abel. We removed part of his tongue to save ourselves from judgment. We removed his eyes to save him from what we removed his eyes from save to save him from witnessing what we had would be coming. And tongue and eye. Is this tongue and this is eyes? Did I do anything with this? Is it hands of a clock? Okay, it looks like 
looks like this moves that hand. And this moves. Okay. Guesswork for the win. <laughs> Yay. Ah, okay. Yep. This was tongue. This is eyes. These are the hands. Lovely. The End of Days by Scythe Death Team. The world is ending as a comet look looms. Can you make it home to your family? Scythe Dev Team was from the first game they did. Carthank? Carthank? Uh, I don't know. I? Is it? Ah. Clotted blood hangs his limb. I didn't really have it <laughs> all at once. It's weird how quickly you calm down after something shakes your whole world. Here I was, confronted with cosmic shapes filling the sky. Shifting and swirling and dancing in ways that makes your mind fold in on itself. But it wasn't long before I was just wondering if someone stopped and pumped up my tires. Hell, people were pissed when I called to check in on them. Why the fuck are you calling at 3 a.m.? I just told them to look up. There seems to be a theme of aliens. Or like, otherworldly stuff. It's weird how Because... I mean... I don't know what this infection is. But, like, we're infected with something. I don't know what. It could be some kind of alien virus. Uh... Toy shop. Some kind of otherworldly thing comes down and does something to people, and it's aliens. Sucker for love, elder gods, ancient alien things, comet. <laughs> it's just like, hmm, hmm. Sus, very sus. Also, their previous in their Dread X collection was about alien mummy. And the sky's all messed up. Starting Guardian Skywatch. Launching uh, near Carthank. What? What? Ah, oh, you're just messing with me. Carthank object detector. Extinction level cataclysm, yes. Emergency sequence, Titan sickle, Titan sickle. Titan sickle launched. Tracking, tracking nuclear payload. Emergency sequence, and all sequences above a failed nuclear missile payload had missed the target. Please refer to the user manual and set instructions. Okay. The end of days. Metal filter. Retro. Grindhouse. Spaghetti. Breadbox. Noir. End of the world. Who saw it coming? Sure, we all like to joke around. Might as well send a comet and start over. But could you blame us? This collective societal apathy was programmed into us after constant exposure to rampant theft, violent crime, homicide, and the government corruption that enabled and monetized it. But the comet, 
The common isn't bringing a cleansing like those doomsday fanatic creeps like to think. The comet isn't the answer to anyone's prayers. The shit hits the fan and I'm a country away. Figures. Just my luck. I've got a ball and a chain to get back to. Away on business. Be good. Bye. George McDonald is 
have I become? What have I become? Let's go. Let's go. Actually, can I break that down? Break down the wall. We do not fight the inevitable. Oof, chunky. Got some good give. Hey. I didn't want to do that. This gas will get me far. I mean, I don't believe you. You're, you're kind of like, I just want to do that. I mean, honestly. I swear I did it. Can I go under here? You made me do this. for what feels like a lifetime, but it's only been a few days. Oh, the first yeah. day was peaceful. A surreal, queasy kind of peaceful. But that all turned Jack's to shit too. fast. Road to nowhere. Doomsday cult are out here looking for sacrifices. On top of that, shards of the comet have started to hit the planet. I've been driving by smoking craters and hearing some strange wildlife out there. 
Call me crazy, but I swear it only started after the comet's meteor showers. I mean, probably. Probably some weird alien shit. First time to regain your bearings. Here. Is this a sequel to Car Think? Is this a le like a legit sequel to Car Think? That's actually from sequel to car thing. This is, this is the sequel to car thing. I'm also glitched. I'm also glitched. I'm dead, but I'm glitched. Feels like a lifetime, but it's only been a few days. He killed First me so much peaceful. that I glitched. <laughs> it's a real queasy kind of peaceful, but that all turned to but shit yeah, in fast. But yeah, in there's those wireframe dudes. Doomsday cult are out here looking for sacrifices. And that plant. On top of that, shards of the comet have started to hit the planet. And been the driving comet by must smoking be from craters that nearing some strange that I was, wildlife that's out like there. Tomb I was Call me crazy, on. but I swear it only started after the comet's meteor showers. Continuation of car thing in some way. Maybe a prequel. Get killed. 
way out. Fuck! I can't shoot one of those. Let's just run. Run! Run! Dog eat dog world. Oh, I have a flashlight. Of course. Silver card thing, it isn't making the stream shut. Flashlight goes out. I cool. made it to Freya. Barely. Barely. This isn't just a comet. It's an alien invasion. Some screeching metallic freaks have invaded Carthag. I had to take a few out to make it through the subway. If I can get inside Diamond Carthage. Point Heights and make it to the top floor, I can get better reception. Hopefully you'll answer. Either way, I'll get to you guys, I promise. Just gotta catch that five-star view we've always wanted first.
this isn't Made just a car. It's an alien invasion. Some screeching metallic... Those are not good sounds. This is not good. There's an arrow. Okay, cool. They go this direction ish.
shouldn't donate all those health packs. Okay, cool.
My pinky's bigger than your brain. My pinky's bigger than your brain. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, clever. Clever one-liner. So Carthag falls and here I am, top of the world. Our species was thriving just a few days ago, but we're going extinct today. Who knows what tomorrow holds? Our world is getting invaded by metallic screamers, riding in on monolithic structures with a demonic red glow to them. Our world is being seeded by comets, alien fungi and tentacles consume the planet. And now as our skyscrapers fall, strange alien temples rising, presumably to imprison the few survivors who knows what nefarious purposes. As quickly as we build civilization, it's been torn apart by these freaks far quicker. But I know I'm not giving up. I'll keep fighting to the end of days. To the end of days. Pretty great. This is pretty great. I don't know why why this music, but uh, as a secret sequel to Car Thing, hmm, ten out of ten. And I gotta say, Car Thing, ten out of ten. So this is like a twenty out of ten right now. That's how that's how numbers work, right? Yeah. Special shotgun surprise? Oh, that's a nice message. Be kind to each other. Oh, I gotta figure out what the surprise is. Music just keep going. Alright. End of the world. Good evening, everyone. We regret to inform that our efforts. Ah, fuck, here we go. God, I can't. I can't. I can't. <laughs> Alright. I completed it, didn't I? something pew 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 <laughs> what the fuck Like go on, like go off, like go on, like go off, like go on, like go off, like go on, like go off. Like 
these paintings are probably a part of a puzzle. Ew. Two bits. I don't get it. Man, bug, wolf, cow, rabbit, water. The king of tithes demands payment to be precise. The pound of flesh is time and blood. equal right this is this precise yeah and then press this Puzzles.
body part. Yikes. Got the key. All right, would one. Charlotte's Exile, then Hand Game, Undiscovered, Weeping Angel, Solipsis, let's just do Charlotte's Exile. Charlotte's Exile by John Zemanski. Charlotte has gone missing. The last hope of her embrace lies with an old note written in an ancient language. It's weird how quickly you calm down after something shakes your whole world. That's what I keep coming back to. The return to normal. The sky was on fire with God knows what, and I actually drove three miles to the next turn off to get back on the southbound freeway. <sighs> because crossing over the middle was illegal at 3 a.m. with no other cars for miles. With the sky on fire. Charlotte's Exile. Thanks. Special thanks to Morgan Harris for the lovely drawings of the creatures found in the book. And yeah, for supplying the excellent book textures. And Dread X Collection. Uh, the Dread X team for an excellent jam. Options. Sound effects. V-Sync. Low... Full screen, low graphics mode. My beloved Charlotte, the woman that had become as much a part of me as I was of myself. She had always been ravenous in studying the ancient texts left of the Elders Elders gods. gods. I didn't understand what she told that me again. about her studies, but I supported her as best I could. I'm sensing a theme. I'm sensing that there is a theme between all these. Aside from them all being in my head, apparently. And then, one day, she began to talk of such things as saving our realm from the incoming evil and being infested by an approaching darkness. I woke the next morning and she was gone. A note left to me only contained the words, I have been banished to the ancient realm. It is for the best. Distraught and searching for anything I could do to bring her back, I sought the help of a miser high in the mountains. He showed me but one hope, 
a torn scrap of ancient text describing the process of recapturing the essence of a loved one from the dark pits of that shadowy place. Torn and ragged, it was written in an eldritch language long forgotten by our culture, known only to those who had contact with the eldritch gods themselves. I snatched the scrap from the old man and brought it to the great library. I thought I could use the texts written there to decode the alphabet of the ancient language so I could know the secrets written on the scrap of paper and bring her back to me. In the library, then, is where my story begins. All right, to the library. Left click to interact. Right click, but oh, where is it? Now? A through Z, other letters, Morse code. No, no, it's not Morse code. That's because there's no dots. These are all dashes. Okay. Can I click on any of this. No. Okay. Let's open the book with the yellow sign. Eldritch beings. <clears throat> Compiled for the study in protection against the Eldritch terrors. There's my first clue. I should jot that down. Monsters Part A. Monsters Part A. Cthulhu. Cthulhu, the dark being. Feared by all, Cthulhu causes the subconscious feelings of anxiety felt by generation to generation. He currently slumbers in the ancient realm, although it's not it is not th Hey Philo, I'm gonna fail to read out loud right now. He currently slumbers in the ancient realm, although it is thought he could return someday. His name was lengthened when translated by the old English scribes, adding to um, in the middle, which usually describe his prominence. Is that there before? Um, a tab hmm? Maybe. Is this CTH? I don't know. The <laughs> Q of Narlatep. It lurks here. If it's close, look at it. This is not going to be fun. Something's going to sneak up on me. <laughs> A servant that carries out duties in Darlatep's absence it is a being that stands in the shadows whose goal is to see the return of its master. It will stalk towards any creature slow. Slowly and quietly, if it knows that Nalatep's return is being threatened. 
it is seen when closing. Um, I'm paranoid now. I am so paranoid. Um, if it is seen when closing in on its goal, whatever it, whatever to be, seems to retreat. Rat mass. The mass of rats. A bunch of rats stuck together with glue. <laughs> yep. Okay. Um, mentioned only once in the ancient text. Horrific for no reason as much as simply being sort of gross. The writer describes it as being no shape in all shapes. No order but no order but all beauty. A sight of true horror and magnificence. The true definition of a one can constrict uh, construct a rat mass at home with proper supplies. Apply glue <laughs> <laughs> Literally. That's the thing. That's that's the thing. I'm watching you. I I'm I'm watching you. Gobble Gobble Gig Oh Gobble Gig Mont uh, Mountainous A pillar of melting flesh spouting from the earth. Gobble Gig appeared only once before being banished by the The earthquake it caused in its, so, in its short time on Earth brought many civilizations to their knees, causing a large rift between those affected and the few nations who were not. It is... Okay, he's gone. It is... No... It, it has no known way to be resummoned. Hounds of uh, three forty. It's not three forty. It's uh eleven. Almost twelve. Eleven five ten fifteen twenty twenty five thirty. Eleven thirty five. Oh. I see you. I see you. Not quite hound, not quite being. The hounds are thought to be too horrific to describe. They are a being that something only in time manifests through space to follow its prey. Yeah, don't. Don't joke about that. <gasps> Shit! Fuck. God damn it, Philo. God, you, you said it. Um, da, da, da. Uh, they, they, they're dogs. They communicate. Hounds. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Oof. You, you, you stay back there. Okay. You. Four armed creatures that live in the darkest, not only in Africa, the mountains. They live on the other, 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 the other
Eldred's devices. Eldred's devices. D. D. All right. Clock of I can wait here all day. I could I could just wait. You know? <sighs> Might as well keep reading. Clock of this name here an artifact stolen from time it itself the clock of da 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 messages caught in time depending on where its hands lay the messages it shows it never ordered okay Um, instead appearing as a string of letters to be sorted out by those who observe them. It is rumored that adjusting its hands uh, creates an altogether new connection from time and space. So, I think since this says 340, when one of these, this appears... I need to set it to 340, which is fucking hell. Got me again. All right. So it would be three, and then this is 30, so boop, boop. And that should get rid of the guy, hopefully. M. <laughs> M. Um, the ancient boar or box I think that's box which is this thing taken from the depths of the ocean this box contains a secret known to the ones that hit it. Ancient texts describe a way the way to open it has been into the streams of time to keep it secret safe with um, the Eldritch Monsters. Tradition holds that the box can be opened through the use of a single word, although many have tried and been unable to Eldritch Bold. Used for banishment and summoning of creatures from the ancient realm to the hu to, <laughs> to the human realm and back. The Eldritch Bold has developed uh, <sighs> was developed as a way to dispel the ancient horrors. The combinations used to conduct these acts been slowly lost over time all those scraps of combinations written in the ancient alphabet sil uh, Christ still I don't know ancient alphabet so Okay, come on, come on, do it, do it, you won't, come on, come on, do it, do it, do it, 
Monsters Part B. Monsters Part B. Star Spawn of Cthulhu. An elder civilization. These beings seem to be made neither of matter nor energy. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> A handful of scripts. Six. <laughs> six Detailing encounters with the star spawn, changing from its own to a different shape, and back again, possibly even to non creature forms. It is unclear what connection they share with Cthulhu and da 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 da. da. Sotho the, the, the toad god. He's a toady boy. The toady boy slumbers in the ancient Rome, oozing small toads out of its pores. It is recorded that these smaller toads either explode after a few moments or cross the dimensionary path. To the hidden realm, where they will take a form of a wild bear <laughs> and then explode. The chunks of these toad bears can be reassembled to make clever gifts of our parties and get togethers. The sugar blob like beings that envelop creature and non creature alike. The sugar possess. Incredible speed and in, in, in immense cold and slow, but slow and become more puddle like in warmth. Early manuscripts seem to view Shugov as harmless creatures, sometimes even shortening their name. see you. I see you. Adding an I. At the end. The common in the ancient language to show endearment. Okay, I don't think I can... <laughs> I'm gonna call this a bit early, because this is too late, and this is gonna have me making a lot of noise, and perhaps waking up people that I don't want to wake up. So, I'm gonna back out of this, and I will do that one later. <laughs> it's a good game, but I have access to the tape. Escape to return. Because I should be able to just like redo the tape again. I don't need to beat the game to um, further the wraparound story. I don't think. Yeah, I can just, like... Put it in. And then it should... Yep. 
<laughs> That's evil, though. This is really evil. <laughs> it's just. Mm, mm. I'm gonna play something wholesome and or just something else. I don't know. It's something else to keep my mind off of them. Terrible lurking horrors. <laughs> Alright. Y'all have a good night. I'm gonna. Maybe. Maybe tomorrow I will, um, or technically later today, I will come back with more Dread X collection, or I'll just take a bit of a break and stream something else. Who knows? Good night. Bye.